Hello everyone, I'm Dame. I'm gonna be your YouTube instructor for the day. Today we're gonna to talk about finding your niche. But first I want you to subscribe because I don't want you to miss out on any of the upcoming content and educational videos. Secondly, don't move until the end of this video because if you miss just one, one of these important steps that I'm gonna show you, you will not be able to successfully find your niche. Okay, I know what you're thinking. There's so many different things out there. Which niche is for me? The answer to that is simple. Let's start with step one. Pick a topic that you're knowledgeable of and something that you love. That way you can ramble on for hours and hours about this topic. So what YouTube is looking for now, a lot of things have changed in the algorithm. It's not just about clicking on and getting a, a, a view because now they want length of the view. So they want the person not only to click on your video, but to watch it all the way through. If not so, the closest to all the way through that you can come. So you want to have related content to keep people on your channel watching your videos back to back. How do you do that? Easy. Stay right there. I'm about to tell you now. So related content, let's say your niche is fitness. So now if someone's watching your fitness video, so now you want to be able to spin off into another video on healthy eating, maybe another one on healthy living. That way the person stays, all your subscribers stay in your channel longer and longer. That way you generate much more watch time. Um, as the uh, subscribers stay on your channel longer and longer, it feeds the YouTube algorithm to push your video out more and more. The longer you can keep your subscribers on your channel, the more you will be in the new YouTube algorithm. That's their key, keeping the subscriber interested and watching your videos back to back. So remember, the key to picking your niche is picking something you love, something that you're knowledgeable of. And I'm gonna tell you the importance of those two in step two, so don't you move, because if you miss just one, of these steps, you will not successfully be able to pick your niche. Okay, step two is simple. Your YouTube video in your niche should have three things, three important keys only. I'm gonna tell them to you right now. When picking your niche, make sure your video is either entertaining, motivational, or educational. Now, I'll tell you why. Because going, once you start to get monetized, once your channel gets monetized, you want some content that can stand the test of time for years to come. Always generating. That's what's going to keep you a steady income. So you want your levels to go like this, up, or you want them to stay even. So in picking entertaining, motivational, and educational, let's say you're doing how-to videos, how to YouTube. So at no time is that niche going to go dead because every day there's hundreds of thousands of people who want to start YouTubing. So that niche, a how-to niche, is very, very, very critical to having a niche that's going to stand the test of time. Motivational. Every day someone wants to get motivated, hundreds of thousands of people. And entertainment, if you got entertaining content, if you have that, that can stand the test of time. Something that, let's say you drop a video, you made a video two years ago, but you drop another educational video this year. Make sure all your content is relatable that the people will go back to two years ago. So that video is always making traction. That's most important. So remember that. Step two, your niche should be either entertaining motivational or educational. Now stay right there. There's one more tip. I don't want you to miss out because if you, if you miss this last one, you will not have a successful niche. So stay right there. Let's get right to it. Okay, finally, step three. This is the most important step. Don't be afraid to follow the leader. When picking your niche, keep in mind all the first two steps I just taught you, but always keep this in mind. Try to follow trending niches because if you don't try to look for something like that nobody's, that nobody's into 
and thinking that it's wide open for you to get into it and get all the views. If nobody's really into it, probably because none of the viewers are into it. It's a dead niche. So always stick with the trending. Always watch your, uh, your competition. Watch what they're doing because that's going to be very important. Try to keep up with whatever works for them. Try to apply that to your platform, which I don't like spin a twist on it, but keep up with trending niches. And I'm going to give you some niches that are trending right now to get you started in case you have no idea what you want to do. So I'm just going to give you the three top trending niches right now, and I hope one of them fits you. Food, travel, fitness, how-to videos. That's four, sorry. Okay, so we got food, travel, fitness, and how-to videos. Those are top trending niches. And I'm about to tell you one that you would have never thought. The top trending niche right now is living out of your vehicle. Yes. The biggest thing is people living out of their vans or their vehicles. Not so much homeless, but people who choose to live the vehicle life. That's one of the biggest niches right now coming into 2023. So I hope everything that I just went over helps you tremendously. We're going to round it up. And one more little ball of information. So step one, start with something that you love and something that you're knowledgeable of. Always keep in mind, create content that can be spent off into related content. Don't just put up in all type of random videos that has nothing to do with the last one. Step two, make sure your niche is entertaining, motivational, or educational. Step three, trendy niches. Don't be afraid to follow the leader, food, travel, fitness, how-to videos, and don't forget living out of your vehicle. I'm just as shocked as you. Maybe outside living out of mine. Thanks for coming out. It's your YouTube instructor, Shada Dang. I hope this was educational for you. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on any of the other upcoming how-to videos. I'm going to show you how to be a YouTube master.